fish and zucchini. I'm gonna fry them both. So it's basically fancy fish and zucchini fries. So I've got two bowls that I'm using to bread the zucchini. I've got one with a mixture of milk and lemon and another with a mixture of cornstarch and salt. So I'm gonna get about half of the batch going, really coat it in the cornstarch. The cornstarch is great for like fried vegetables because they fry up really light. They don't have a really heavy flour batter about them. Just watch, you'll see. So I'm gonna fry these until they're golden. I'll take them out to drain. I'll do the same thing with the second batch of zucchini, and then I think I'll go wash my hands. So, Paigey, look at this zucchini. Mm. And then I've got some sea salt, and I am pretty generous with the sea salt. Sprinkle it. Oh, that looks so good. Okay, I'm gonna put this into a 200 degree oven just to keep it warm while I make the fish. All right, let's go do Operation Fish, Paige. Okay, so. For the breading for the fish, I'm gonna check the temperature on the oil. I've got two pans again. I've got one with seasoned flour, just flour, salt, and pepper. And then I've got a second pan with a little bit more flour, and I'm gonna add some cornstarch and baking powder and brewski, otherwise known as beer. Take a sip. It's like, no. <laughs> I would never do that. <laughs> All right, and then I'll whisk this together. So you guessed it, the fish is basically a beer batter. And there's really no reason you couldn't do both the fish and the zucchini in the same batter. You kind of wanted to save time. Okay, so look at this batter page. You can make pancakes out of it. <laughs> can you imagine beer pancakes? Oh, yum. I wouldn't argue with that. I mean, you'd have to figure out what kind of syrup to put on top. But. Bourbon, I'm just kidding. <laughs> like a bourbon syrup. You are just full of good ideas. <laughs> so I've got just regular white fish and I cut it into little kind of fingers. So I'm putting it into the seasoned flour first and then right into the batter and then drop it right into the oil. And I'm gonna keep working to get the fish into the oil. I'll probably do them in two batches. See you on the other side. So the second batch of fish is done. I'm just trying to find a paper towel to put it on. Okay. Mm. And I made sure to get all the little kind of extra little crispy bits. I got the zucchini out of the oven while I was running around like crazy. So I've got the sea salt. And I'm gonna sprinkle it on the fish too. I'm very generous with sea salt, as you can tell. And then I have a beautiful platter to serve it. Some parsley. So store-bought tartar sauce. There is nothing wrong with it. I'm just gonna scatter, ooh, it's hot. Scatter the fried zucchini to and fro. I kinda like it to just be one big, beautiful platter of craziness. Oh gosh, the fish is hot too. <laughs> okay, stack the fish up. Yum, yum, yum. Who's excited? I'm excited. And then lemons galore. Just kinda pile them here and there. Do a little squeeze just to start the lemon process. Mm. Beautiful. And then just some fresh parsley, kind of big little piece, big little, big pieces of leaves. <laughs> All right, fancy fish and fries. I mean, how good does this look? How good does this taste? 
taste. I'll tell you. What? Perfection. Oh. <laughs>